It might not seem the most pleasurable pastime on a sunny afternoon, but ecologist Mark Gurney is in his element, hunting for insects in cowpats. And it's in one on this very spot in North Kent where the rare Maid of Kent beetle was found. This is just a cowpat, but living in cowpats, there's a whole community of insects and other tiny creatures that live on the dung and living on them. There are bigger predators, and this beetle is one of them. It's about an inch long. It's thought to be the first time this bee-like beetle has been found on the RSPB reserve at Cliff. There have been a handful of other sightings on other reserves nearby over the past decade, but until then it was thought to have been extinct. It's a very, very elusive thing, so people occasionally gets found like this and everybody comes and looks for it and they don't find it and they keep looking for years and years and they don't find it and it turns up again. So why has it turned up here? One theory is the environmentally friendly farming methods used on the reserve and around. We can't use uh, chemicals or any type of fertiliser up here. If we'd have used this certain type of wormers on the cattle, it would have killed the beetle, and I think that's why we've ended up with these rare species on the marsh. It may be years before another Maid of Kent beetle is spotted, but now it's been seen once again. Sifting through cowpats and their wildlife has given the experts a sense of anticipation. Yvette Austin, BBC South East Today, Cliff.